I think we can all agree that mounts are a unique part in Terraria. We usually find a mount in hard mode or pre-hard mode, but after we get pixie wings or any sort of types of wings, we usually forget about them and move on. I must say though that there is one specific amount that you should not forget about, and that is the queen slime mount. This queen slime mount is absolutely insane. Let's go over the basics on why it's really useful. Number one, it's jump boost is extremely fast. You go, go up in the air extremely fast and you can do it for a long period of time. It also has a little glide effect and it's basically the king slime mount, which is also another really good mount, but 10 times better. This mount could be used to go up against some of the hardest bosses in Terraria. I mean, just look how easy I'm dodging Duke Fishron. No, I'm not using any buffs or any sort of arena. I'm just using a platform and the Queen Slime Mount. You can see how much easier I'm dodging his attacks. And Duke Fishron is not the only one who you can use this mount against. You can use this mount against any other boss and it would still work just as well. You can even use it against Moon Lord. The only two bosses I don't recommend this mount on is the Destroyer and Golem, since Golem doesn't have too much space in its arena. But even Destroyer 2, you could still somewhat use it if you like. But other than those two bosses, everything else, this Queen Slime Mount makes your life a whole lot easier. Even the twins. Look how easy I'm dodging the twins. I'm just going around in a circle. This Queen Slime Mount makes dodging 10,000 times easier against any other bosses. Like I said, other than the Destroyer and Golem. And not only that, it also has a slight chance to dodge an attack even if you get hit. Say, for example, I landed on Duke Fishron's head. If I had the Queen Slime out, it has a chance to bounce off Duke Fishron's head and I won't take a hit. Sounds too good to be true, huh? Well, fortunately, it is true. This mount exists, and I do not understand why people are not using it. In order to obtain this mount, all you have to do is kill the easiest pre hardened boss, Queen Slime, with 18,000 health. Not the hardest task in the world, but trust me, once you get this mount, it is extremely useful. Go ahead and try it out yourself. It's not even that hard to learn as well. You could probably learn it in like five minutes. You could learn how to use this thing in like three minutes, the first boss you fight, and you'll see for yourself why this thing is absolutely amazing. In my opinion, this is the best slime mount in the entire game. And not only slime mount, the best mount in the entire game. If you find the king slime mount very useful, which is again also a very underrated mount for pre-hard mode, Basically, Queen Slime is King Slime Mount, but 10 times better and is the hard mode version. Please give the Queen Slime Mount a try, okay? It's amazing. The best part is it's not even that hard to use at all. You could probably learn how to use it in five minutes. But that's all I wanted to say. If you guys stuck to the end, feel free to like and subscribe because we are on a goal to reach 1,000 subscribers before the end of the year. So if you could like and subscribe, it would mean the world to me. Not only that, there will be a lot more commentary videos like this. So if you like gaming, you like Terraria, you love commentary, I recommend to subscribe. Other than that, I'll see you guys in my next video.